Modern architecture is a new architectural style that emerged in many Western countries in the decade after World War I. It was based on the rational use of modern materials, the principles of functionalist planning, and the rejection of historical precedent and ornament. By 1920, there was an increasingly wide understanding that building forms must be determined by their functions and materials if they were to achieve intrinsic significance or beauty in contemporary terms without resorting to traditional ornament. Instead of viewing a building as a heavy mass made of ponderous materials, the leading innovators of modern architecture considered it as a volume of space enclosed by light, thin curtain walls and resting on slender piers.
Abstract Expressionism is a post-World War II art movement in American painting developed in New York in the 1940s. It developed in the context of diverse, overlapping sources and inspirations. Breaking away from accepted conventions in both technique and subject matter, the artists made monumentally scaled works that stood as reflections of their individual sites, and in doing so, attempted to tap into universal inner sources. These artists valued spontaneity and improvisation, and they accorded the highest importance to process. Their work resists stylistic categorization, but it can be clustered around two basic inclinations, an emphasis on dynamic, energetic gesture in contrast to a reflective cerebral focus on more open fields of color. In either case, the imagery was primarily abstract. Even when depicting images based on visual realities, the abstract expressionists favored a highly abstracted mode. topic of our discussion, let's learn the art of popular culture or simply pop art. It was the visual art movement that characterized the sense of optimism during the post-war consumer boom of the 1950s and 1960s. It coincided with the globalization of pop music and youth culture personified by Elvis and Beatles. Pop art was brash, young and fun, and hostile to the artistic establishment. It included different styles of painting and sculpture from various countries. But what they all had in common was an interest in mass media, mass production, and mass culture. 